Okay, I messed with a few things. Gonna see if that ups the frames. Let's continue looking for this rope. Quest for rope. Chapter 2 of 7. But you ride in the Everett. Yeah, it would be rude just to barge in. I mean, I know it's a zombie well, apocalypse. Hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? I want to help you rope. with anything around the house. I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Alright, uh... It actually looks better than uh, the boys and I my house. To adapt as best my house is like one of those new but houses right now. I'm not a fan. To help remind us of better times. What happened to the rest of your staff? Oh, we've had our share of tragedy here. Just like everyone else, I'm sure. Some of our staff took off to find their family as soon as they heard the news. The few that stuck around, well, we lost most of them the first night those things showed up here. It was oh, a tough night. How many rooms does this house have? 72. Rooms? Why do you ask? It looks custom built. Nice of you to notice. My husband put a lot of work into this old house. Well, he did a fantastic job. I believe in making a house a home. Good. Well, if anything to comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. No problem. Now then, where can I find some freaking rope? Uh, let's check over here in this box. I'm robbing you people blind. Oh, there's rope. Perfect. Give this me. rope is perfect for the swing. <laughs> he said that with really dead eyes, just like, this rope is perfect. For many things. Man, I keep implying that Lee's just gonna kill everybody. My yes. Ugh. Something's in my head is not okay right now. They usually get this way after oh, work. I this I, I don't enjoy tough. my work very much. Though it's only a part-time job. Dead. I really don't like it. I fixed Mama's the swing. gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. I'm sure they love Did it. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Yes. Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Yeah, I imagine the zombie apocalypse would make anything sweet and happy, memory-wise, seem... Even sweeter. I mean, seriously, I'll I'll be honest. I would not. I would always revert back to memories as soon as I could. It'd be like, so what have you? Oh, we're done out? work for the day. This is yeah. looking like a good place to stay. Better times and make believe. I didn't get a chance to check out the barn area yet. I'll do that after helping Andy get the perimeter secured. I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. All right, let's uh let's go help with the perimeter. Oh, I have my axe back. Didn't even notice. Hi. Hi. Awkward. Mark and Awkward I can help you perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the you fence know that from experience. if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. All right. See, I'm kind of wary of what's hidden in the barn. Are we gonna find like a stack of corpses? And I don't mean like a pile. I mean like a routine stacked pot, like group of corpses. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can. It's pretty amazing what they've done with the stair. It's true. Let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. <laughs> it wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. Jeez. I, I'm, I'm sorry. Where'd that come from? We'll work it out somehow. Well, Jeez. hopefully he'll come. He had a freaking mood swing there. 
I think the way I'm playing the game is making him bipolar. There's one. Ugh. Definitely dead. Lee, it's He's dead. Cooked. Come on, let's push it off. Looks like somebody shot an arrow into it first. Disgusting. You never know when you're gonna need an arrow. Oh, I didn't even get to keep it, did I? Come on, with those sure vacant eyes. Once this fence is patched Always up, this place will be a fortress. God, see them in their can you nightmares. imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? The fortress needs it's people to needs defend people. it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. All right. Thanks. Glad There's to know another that, Mark. One. You seem like a true I friend in all this. You and Kenny are friends. Lily is all right. Carly is also a friend. Oh, this one grab. Uh, jump, jump. Man, the fence burnt right into its hands. Oh, had, had to switch. Fused together. This is a. I'm pretty sure this is a girl, dude. <laughs> and. Secondary jump. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. <laughs> Big Christ. lighthearted things. Can't about stop it. thinking about dinner. Hey, you Thanks got some of the to rations do. earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Hey, I fed the kids too. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? Uh, I'd imagine if so. If got as much food as they say, I, I think so. They appear to be a generous Come on. group of people. I think I see people, where they're But I don't in. think things are going to go this as planned. This one must have knocked it over trying to get anybody. through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Uh, I'll be honest, I would not go on the outside of the fence. My opinion would be... Nah, I'd probably have to do the same thing. Though I'd probably say one person do a lookout Holy where the other fuck. one... What just happened? The fences are on! Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows where Something dastardly is happening! Ah. Treachery is afoot! What the right, behind the tractor now! Okay. No, behind the tractor now! Mark, you may have not been in the first chapter, but I actually like you. You're alright. Okay, we learned something about tractors last time. We learned that they work basically like automatic cars. Now we're gonna take one too. I feel it. Of course. Not what I meant. Get down. Okay, drop that, because that's definitely keeping us stuck. Or lift it, I mean. Let's see if we can move it now. Nope, still no. Uh, must be out. Oh, God. Stop shooting at us! What about our arrangement? Oh, there we go. Move that. Come on. We can reach the gate. You didn't get any get of us. It's your turn. Ah! They're on the Shit, that hurts. Mark, get closer to the tractor. Seriously, that one almost killed you. I don't want you to die. The other person I really want to die is Larry. That one is not cooked. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. No, it isn't. Gonna have to move it. It's not cooked enough. Axe it in the head. That one didn't look like one of the other ones. I think that one was live. Another one? Or did we push down more than I thought we did? This one pushed down more than I thought we did. Nope, that one's still alive. Get off of me! Oh, 
Get the hell away from me. Okay. Holy shit, he has some freaking muscles on him. You okay? Yeah. Barely. Dude, you should have just thrown it into the fence. Right Cook it alive. Oh, no good. Ooh, nice headshot. Let's get out of here. I have to admire your arrow skills. I am not very good with a bow in real life. I've only ever fired like three arrows though, so. And that was in gym class. Like five years ago. Man, that was that was heck. That was before I lived. What's wrong? Well, my friend. The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are, are you okay? Wait, why don't they just come through the fence? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? Wait, the fence went on. Bastards in the woods. Four. Well, yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hmm. Hey, y'all. Mark, shoulder. oh my god, what happened? You got shot with an arrow. Christ, shoulder. are you gonna be okay? Oh wait, that's not even the yeah. shoulder, that's like mid-back. That might have punctured a lung. Pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Actually, we come should have, uh, now. We'll have your we should have Kendra now. working on that. Well, you must be the what kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. Why don't the bandits just come through the gate and they gave overrun us a lot them and take all the food? The beginning, killed a bunch of our what farm hands. things have you done? We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. For God that. damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. It was, it was a just a fluke thing. Can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell sure. do you mean a fluke? It could have happened. I mean, anywhere. shut up, Lily. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with Give this. Give me a gun you know in the right direction, are? and we'll make They're sure some of them down. Die. But I think I know where Horror. at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? Yes. This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. True. I think all of us and our guns motor can handle a couple of punks safe. with bows and arrows. Also what we true. need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out eat to then Rambo. Got it. Bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, yeah real charming. That's real charming, Dad. Ha <laughs> Where's Ben and Carly? Me Since and Carly Lily. and Ben ate some of the food Make on the way jokes. to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Well, hey, kid. Look what Lee okay. got working for I was wondering for if uh, Duck swings. and Clem were there. I love there. swings. Just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. I will give you a push on this way. You're the best. I yeah. know I am. False arrogance is the best. Real arrogance, not so much. False arrogance is funny, though. Or at least to me it is. Let's go check on the kids before we do anything else. Hey, duck. Hey, Clem. And then I'll talk to Kenny afterwards. This is one of those hey, moments Clem, where you can you almost like think that there aren't people yeah, being eaten it's alive. Fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Of course. Sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Duck reminds me of somebody from when I was a kid. I don't know who. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little it's worried bother about Mark. Me. I'll figure it Is out. Is Mark going to be okay? You got lucky out there. It would have been a lot worse. I don't know. It looks like his lung got punctured, as I said earlier. Yeah, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. By making sure they don't get back up. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's There's going to be milk it reminds and me cheese. Of how you That's even not before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? 
Yeah. I'm not sure Eventually. when. Eventually. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, yeah I figured eventually too. somebody would be able to figure out this whole thing. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? Man, this is some pretty, like, lame swinging, I'll be yes. honest. I I'll be going at least right, three man. times that high. Way. Okay, thanks for pushing me. Of and then I'd jump it's off, because that would be fun. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. Alright, let's talk to Kenny. There's not much to say to Duck, he's not the... Where am I going?